to be one, right? Let's come back in the morning. You can get whatever tools you need, and we'll finish it up then. There will be fewer freaks out. So no hot shower tonight? OK, but I want to show you something first. Oh, Ricky, it's been a long day. Come on, you know a lot about the freaks. I just want to show you something you might not know. Come on, we're out here anyway. Shit, OK. Let's go. Can I ask you something? Yeah, like I said before, could I stop you? Why are you still flying colors? I don't know what you mean. I mean, why do you still wear the cuts? You and Boozer, it's, it's not like you're trying to recruit anymore or, or staking out territory. No. A couple of guys I worked with at the plant wore colors on the weekend. I asked them about it once. They said they wore them as a way of saying, fuck you, to, I don't know, the cops, authority, the government. So what are you rebelling against? Whatever's left. Look, we wear them because we wear them. What do you want? I mean, no idea about Boozer, but I ain't trying to say shit. It's just... Cut. That's who I am. I've done a lot of stupid shit in my life, but joining the MC, well... Let's just say that it's one of the few things that I don't regret. Ricky, what are we doing here? I've seen the Nero death trains before and hordes. I know. Not like this. What the fuck? Watch. I've come out here a few times to see them. They stay in those old machine buildings and they come out every night like someone's ringing a dinner bell, right? When it's morning, they go back inside and what? Hibernate? You mean you never went down there to see? Aha. Uh -huh. No. One time I got way too close, and a dozen of them started chasing me. It's like poking a hornet's nest. Come on, let's get out of here. It's getting dark. Hey, where the hell have you been all day? Nice to see you, too. Yeah, well, Schizo said you and Deacon took off, and I was worried. Addie, I'm tired, okay? Oh, that's rich. Hey, Dee, thank you. Yeah, well, just let me know when you're ready to tackle that transformer. I'll be around. Sure. It's bullshit. What is your problem? No, no, what is your problem? I just said, I'm tired. That's it. Okay. I'm sorry. Like I said, I, w I was worried. It's not like you to just take off without talking to me. Okay. So that's it? Today I'm never getting back. 
pissed off. Oh, hey, look at that. Too late for marsh duty. Yeah, he's too bad, huh? Schizo. Schizo, schizo. Speaking of schizo, I wonder what the hell he did all day. <laughs> All right. Uh, you would come back soon, hey. huh? How's life? Oh, okay. Hold on. That's it. Open in the gate. Hey, Ricky, you send some men to go out and get him? Yeah, he's a lot more cooperative all of a sudden. Evidently, our guys got to him just before a swarm. They offered to leave him where he was if you didn't tell him where the seats were. Oh, that's so weird. <laughs> yeah, I, I really would have just left him there to rot. Yeah, you know what Iron Mike would say about that? Yeah, 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 I know. See you, Ricky. All right, see you, Deke. Good to see you, Deke. Believe it or not. Hey, damn it. Farewell. I think we had a pretty good training. Got fast. It wasn't St. John, I got a bounty job so for you. I'm listening. You're looking for Ned Walker. Where's a red nuts. scarf? He and his crew came to the gate the other night. We wouldn't let him in. He killed one of my guards and took off. Hmm. You have someone to follow him? He's holed up at a marauder camp just north of O'Leary Mountain. I think you know where that is. No, but I'll find him. Deacon St. John. Damon. I want to thank you for not killing the man. We're going to have a trial. We'll get a chance to tell his side. That's great. Man. Too bad Campbell and Reed aren't allowed to tell their side. Hey, we got folks that'll be there speaking on their behalf. And we got witnesses. It's the way we do things, Deke. Why don't you give them to me for five minutes? You'll have a confession. Thanks. We got it covered. Iron Mike out. Ricky, you there? I'm, uh, I'm gonna be gone for a while. I'm gonna need you to cover for me. Skiz is gonna wonder why I'm not out on marsh duty or whatever the hell. Hey, Deke. What's up? Boozer's, uh, hell. He's, he's depressed or something. Talk to Adam. 
I think I know a way to cheer him up. Uh, I thought I'd maybe head to O'Leary Mountain and get his bike. And bring it back. That's a long way to go on foot. Let's figure something out. Are you, are you gonna cover for me or what? out. St. John out. Hey, I brought you something. Wait, what the fuck? You you went up and got my bike? Well, I didn't want Cope getting it, parting it out. Jesus, Dick. Hey, I mean, I mostly did it, you know, in case I need parts. It's not like your gimp ass is gonna need them. Shit. Thanks, brother. That's the one thing I miss. Been on the open road.
just wanted me to tell you that she paid some men to go get your bike and bring it back. It's over at the mechanic's shop. Oh, wait, what? You're welcome, Deke. Ricky out. Deke, a group of men rode in, shot up the gate, and when we wouldn't let them in, they rode off. Ah, shit. Which direction? Uh, they headed west, but they didn't go far. They set up camp just north of Eden Hill. I think they might be planning another attack, so I need you to take a look. <sighs> okay, right. Yeah, I'll handle it. Thanks, Deke. Looking to buy, Hope. Hey, how's it going? What's up? Just checking in. A couple of my men were up to the top of Leary Mount the other day. Said they found a safe house set up in an old Forest Service watchtower. Is that right? Yes, sir. That's what I'm told. They said it was abandoned, but funny thing. Whoever lived there left behind a bike. In good shape, too, by the sound of it. Really? Indeed. 
that's not the funny thing. The funny thing is they went back up there today to pick it up, but Mike was gone. Now ain't that a head scratch? Well, the purpose is not really fascinating, but uh. Now hold on, here's the fascinating part. They swear that old bike will look a lot like the one that was here to ride. Okay, so let me get this straight, Co. You guys went up to O'Leary Mountain. You found what you thought was Boozer's bike. And the first thing you thought of was, hey, why don't we just go back and steal it? Salvage, dude. Salvage. But no, that was my second thought. My first was, what ever happened to old Boozer? Man, he says he hasn't seen him around for some time. I don't know, Cope. Next time I see him, I'll let him know how much you miss him. St. John out! O'Brien, I'm at one of your beacons, the one near Camp Creek. Uh, there's nothing here. Hold on. Uh, okay. A field ops should be there any minute. You know the drill. O'Brien out. Yeah, I know the drill. Try not to get my ass shot off while being your goddamn peeping Tom. St. John out. Yeah, so what was that all about? I mean, last time we talked, it sounded like you were pissing your hazmat suit. It's nothing. I, I told you, there are people above me who don't want us to know what's going on. I got too close, I almost got caught. I need the area secured now. You know what? I don't give a shit. All I want from you is information on Sarah. Standing by. Whitaker, I've got someone working on it. It's... it's gonna take time. I guess... You have to be patient. Yeah? <laughs> well, I don't I got a lot of choice here, do I? This research group isn't part of my unit, so I can't track them after this op. I need you to... Place a tracker on their chopper. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Oh, and you want me to spy on the guy wearing the white spacesuit? Yeah, anything else? Yeah, try not to get your ass shut off. <laughs> your, uh, calm was still open before. Oh, <laughs> 
almost clean, right? I mean, not clean, but most freaks are so caked with shit and piss. Yeah, it's disgusting. Yeah, well, again, put a pair of pants on a baboon for two years. Jesus. You ever wonder why there's so many more freaks in areas with loose? thought about it. But yeah, I guess they do. Yeah. We think there might still be something buried deep in their massively deformed heads. Jesus, you don't think they're aware of them. No, no, we've done the CT scans. They might as well be brain dead. Human terms. What's that mean? I don't know. That's what we're here to find out. Well, what it means is that some freaks get up in the morning, they shower, they get dressed, they put on their favorite gold watch, they kiss their wife goodbye, and then they head out the door for a fun day of meeting us and shitting themselves. Why the hell are these guys wasting their time with this shit? <sighs> Hope you got all that, O'Brien. Okay, now just gotta get the hell out of here anyway. What you told? The ship? O'Brien, are you there? O'Brien! It wasn't even my turn. <laughs> Hold on. Yes, it was. No, yeah, I'm here. Inside. I planted your tracking device and I got your data. The researcher, were they male or female? What? What? Why? Was it a man or a woman? Uh, it was a woman and... No, I didn't catch your name. Okay, time to break you in and let Ricky know. Deacon, how'd it go? It's done. They won't be shooting up any more camps. Thank God. I'll let Iron Mike know. You know, keep this up and you and Mike are gonna be best friends before you know it. Bye, Deacon. Shot up the gate, took off. Hey, Mike, yeah. Uh, I found them and they won't be coming back. Seems like it's getting worse. A lot of squatters and drifters we got coming through. No offense to present company. None taken. Uh, and yeah, Mike, it's getting worse. I don't know. Mike, I think it's like you were saying about tourists always coming up here from California. Well, I guess if I had a choice, yeah, I'd rather be here than down there. Yeah, nice bunch of rapists, thieves, and murderers. What you doing out here, huh? Looking for your next easy target? Deacon, you there? Yeah, Addy, what's up? Can you stop by the infirmary if you get a chance? Anything wrong? No, I just wanted to talk to you. Uh, yeah, okay. 